Bars, restaurants, and retailers were looking forward to getting a business boost this weekend. And 3 News Now reporter Jessica Edson has more on how the game cancellation will affect businesses in downtown Lincoln. Tuesday's news of the Huskers home game being canceled has a lot of fans disappointed, but here in Lincoln, businesses are also feeling the sting. For the best of big red shop in downtown Lincoln, football season brings in about 75% of their sales for the year. But the first home game, that's almost like a holiday for the shop. On a normal game day on this side, I mean, there's times where I can't even get through. I've had to run around outside to go to the front door. I've had to run through the other side. I mean, it's wall to wall people. With the coronavirus already slowing down sales this year, hearing that Saturday's game would be canceled was definitely a disappointment. I wasn't shocked because um, I kind of knew that it was probably going to happen. But when they do that final announcement, you're just kind of like, oh, we were almost there. For other businesses that aren't quite so Husker focused, the news still brought some uneasiness. Ease. Screamers Dining and Cabaret has only been in the Haymarket area for two years. And while the restaurant focuses on stage performance, they still bring in Husker fans when the game takes center stage. First year, of course, was pretty tough because nobody knew we were here or knew about us. And then the second year got a little better. We were looking forward to this year still building on that. Um, so we don't really know what's going to happen now. That's a sentiment shared by many businesses as they are changing gears just days before the Huskers were scheduled to play. They are hoping the warm weather and Halloween will still bring out customers to make up for some of that loss. Reporting in Lincoln, Jessica Edson, 3 News Now. And along with that canceled game, business owners say rising coronavirus cases have also played a part in low customer turnout lately.